John Robbins for SASilverStars.com here with new Silver Stars head coach Sandy Brondello. Obviously, we've got uh, a big announcement to make. You're now the head coach of the San Antonio Silver Stars. Just talk about that, how that came to be about. Well, at the end of last season, you know, Dan spoke about moving into the GM role uh, full time. Um, you know, obviously there was an opportunity to be a head coach and he spoke to Olaf and I about that and he just said, we're both ready for the job. And, but, you know, you know, I was the lucky one in this time and, um, you know, I'm just very grateful for the opportunity to be the next head coach. And we talked to Dan earlier. He said that you're very prepared to move in to that head coaching role. Just talk about what you bring to the table, what your skill set is to be a head coach. Well, you know, I've been lucky, you know, the five years that I've coached under uh, Dan as an assistant, he's, a, he's enabled me to grow as a coach um, daily. We'll have more responsibilities every year and, you know, there's a lot of hands-on teaching on the court and, um, you know, I just think I'll just be me. I mean, I think I'm a positive person. I've learned a lot over my career, um, you know, being 18 years professional, I've been coached from great, great, great coaches. And, um, yeah, but I've learned a lot, you know, obviously from Dan in the last five years. And, you know, I'll just be positive, but I'm real uh, detailed oriented. And, um, you know, I love to teach a game, but I'm, I'm real precise in, you know, how I like to play. So, but in saying that, being precise, I also want the players to have fun. And we told Coach Hughes that he'll always be Coach Hughes, even though he's stepping into that <laughs> full time general manager role. How much is he going to be around to, to mentor and whatnot as we go through this initial season with you as the head coach? Well, I think he'll be around a lot. I mean, uh, maybe people don't understand that um, Olaf, Dan and I, we had a great working relationship and, you know, we have a great friendship and um, have a lot of respect for Coach Hughes. He's done a lot for women's basketball and particularly in the WNBA. Um, so I'll be using him as a mentor. Definitely. I mean, I, you know, they say I'm a rookie coach. I have a lot of experience, but I'm going to be learning every single day too. So um, I'll be utilizing him as much as I can and, you know, taking whatever advice that he can. So uh, I just think that's the smartest thing to do. So he'll be around the team a fair bit. And one of his bits that we had last year on the website was Dan's musical journey. Can we expect to see Sandy's musical journey this year? <laughs> oh, I think you got more chance of my musical journey than Olaf's, but um, no, I suppose that's not one of my biggest strengths. Uh, I know I'll have to try and find a, a strength that I can have, but dancing and that's, you know, that's not my thing. I like music, but not on the extent that Dan does. <laughs> well, getting back to the basketball, you know, the 2010 season is not that far away. Just talk about the duties that you have now as head coach today and going forward and what you're doing to, to really put that into motion to get ready for that 2010 season? Well, it really hasn't changed um, much from the years gone past. I mean, um, you know, obviously we're talking about scenarios and trying to get the best team we can on the court. And, you know, the next few months, you know, we, Dan, Olaf and I, we talk together and, you know, OK, can we go after this player, that player? How, we can, how can we improve on last season? Um, and then other than that, you know, Olaf and I, you know, we're brainstorming now. Um, you know, in the past, we've had a lot of responsibilities with offensive and defensive schemes. So it's, it's no different than that. But we just want to make sure that we're ready and uh, we have the right schemes in place that suit the personnel that we'll have. All right. Well, good luck, Coach. And uh, we'll be back with more with head coach Sandy Brondello all through this season as she becomes the Silver Stars head coach. For SASilverStars.com, I'm John Robbins.